in class. Hi. Okay, are you ready, Howie? Yeah. Okay, that screen tells me yes, you are ready. Okay, we are gonna be learning about cause and effect. What is cause and what is effect? Let me give you an example. Yes, hubby. I heard you scream the first three times. Okay, you don't have you don't have to say it again. It's okay. Okay. Cause is something that happens. And effect is everything that happens because of this event. Okay. The cause is so this is the event that happened you were late to school effects of being late to school you might get in trouble by the teacher you might just get a tardy or you might get in trouble by the principal get some sort of principal's office so because of this this all happened Usually you can go, if you got the cause, you can also get the effect. Things that might have happened because of this event. One thing that could, um, that a lot of things do is give you the effect first and then go back to what can cause it. So if I said, oh, you got all money. That was the effect. You got all money. That's what something happened. What caused you to get all money? To get all money? Well, a lot of things can cause that. It could have been you fell. Okay. Another thing would have caused this would have been you through that you were playing with mud. Okay. Or your friend threw it at you. Okay. It can go both ways. If you have the cause, it's the event. The ah! Javi, you don't need to be screaming. I see you. Okay. Are you ready, Javi? Are you done screaming? Ah! The last one. Last one. Okay. If you have the event, you can tell me things that happened because of it. If you have the effect, that means uh, this happened because this event did it first. Okay, that's cause and effect. You can go both ways. If you have this one, you can tell me what caused it. If you have the cause, tell me what happened because of it. Okay? And yes, Javi, you can start screaming again. Ah! And that's it.